Welcome, friends, to The Scrapbook, a creative writing podcast where we create stories organically from a few pieces of paper randomly selected from three different subjects, genre, setting, time period. I'm your host, Jody Pratt, with my fellow host, Patrick Wigfall. Let the story begin. Setting. Asia. Well, Asian heavy this first season. <laughs> 1950s. Okay. And... Ooh, this is mockumentary, bro. <laughs> this is good as fuck. Yeah, you know. Which Asian country will we go for? There's a lot of them. South. Yeah. Sci-fi. It's Godzilla sci-fi? Yeah. What was happening in Asia in the 50s? They weren't in a war, right? No. Some of them were. Some were fighting for their freedom and shit, I believe. Ooh. Korean War was in the 50s. The Korean War was in the 50s? I believe so. That was in the 70s. Is it? Nah, can't be. <laughs> I'm yeah. looking at you now, bro. The Korean War? Yeah. 52. Then 53? Yeah. I don't know a lot, but I come close. 1950s, so we could, we could do the Korean War. Sci-fi, what if we explain the reason why they split. America lost? Oh, okay. No, I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> yeah, for sure, dog. What, no, did we like, lose that? Well, we, we, were, we left. I know, but we weren't trying to take it over. We were trying to do something. And, we, and we, we aided South Korea. But we, we left, though. That, like, that wasn't how, like, America stayed for way too long. We were I, like, it's, we're going we're gonna to pack it up. But we... Because they met a conclusion to that shit. I don't think it was a conclusion. Yeah, they split into two instead of North Korea taking everything. Oh, I'm thinking of, uh, what am I thinking of? What? Nam. Nam, there you go. That's what I'm thinking of. Vietnam yeah. is yeah. what I'm thinking of. I don't, I don't even know yet a war with Korea. Not with the Korea, but like part of it. I believe they they tried to, the, it was the North and the South and shit, and we popped in it. I believe. I'm not sure. So, Korean War. Where's Korea at? Right by Japan. So, it's an island? Mm, kind of. Korea's, con- North Korea's connected to China. And then it's kind of like a peninsula. Kind of. It's just some of the ocean. Then. Mm. Or the reason why they split into two factions, right? Okay. Um, should we do like a like Asian short story type of thing where it's like a fable? Oh, that'd be cool. That's science fiction. And it's like the whole shit is based in a reality, but all of it's fake, mm-hmm. kind of thing. Yeah. Okay. So it would it would, it would be like um, there's tigers in in North Korea. Right, I believe so because they said it in um, the interview. Yeah, is there tigers in Korea though? If there is, that's crazy. Yeah, it's already in there. The Siberian tiger or a moor tiger is a population of the tiger subspecies. Up there, yeah, uh, native to Russia, Far East, Northeast China, and possibly North Korea. Not a part of China, but it's connected together. All right, I didn't even know there was any like real predators in Korea. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, so we can let's do um tigers that morph into people. Right? And that's how they got the, the fable of the Kim Jong un and the nigga who uh came before him, proceeded him mm-hmm. was they were those morphing tigers 
right? Mm-hmm. And you don't eat or shit in your human form. It's only in your tiger form. Uh, you know what I mean? So all the powerful shit, like, oh, he doesn't shit. He doesn't eat. He does this and that. He doesn't have sex. That's because the nigga can't do it in his human form. So he does it when he turns back into an animal. What do you think about that? Tell me to go fuck myself. It's cool. No, I, li- I like the the direction. I just don't want Kim Jong Un in it. But I get, but I get what you mean. Like, like, like that's the the fable yeah, yeah, of, yeah, yeah. of what people believe in them. And they would say, what that, if, yeah, what if it's somebody seeing a real one and finding out that King Jong Un isn't that? Yeah, he missed all the fucking description of. He's like, you're just yeah. a regular human, dude. You shit. But this, this woman I meet in the bamboo fields over here, she really can do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What 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 is what is the pressing issue for him finding her then? Mm-hmm. Like like the like the the person that's churning into this tiger. Uh-huh. Are they doing that just to feed and then going back to being a human? They're they're trying to breed more. The population's dwindling. Mm-hmm. Um, because it's kind of like a kitsune and shit like that. So the population is dwindling. They need more people to cr- procreate with. Mm-hmm. They can turn humans into these motherfucking things. To actually, they can make the female be the vessel to have them. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Or even the males too. We saw twins. I mean, goddamn, should, Mr. Mama. Should, should it be like Dragon Ball and they have a tail? Oh, that'd be pretty fucking dope. Yeah. I like that. But there's no, like, superhero stuff. No, 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 no. But you're a real life tiger, though. You're yeah. a 200 pound yeah. cat. You, you can turn into a, a fucking tiger, though. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? And you eat shit. Yeah. You eat shit. You turn into a tiger, like. So, what if it was like a, like a, almost like a, like a classical, like, Japanese love story and, uh, uh, or uh, any kind of uh, Korean love story, but the man is in love with the woman who's killing. Mm. Yeah, and to like ease her uh, her her uh, dislike of herself, he like asked to become one or something like that. Mm, like I hold, her, I hold her, baby. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this shit together. Like I don't care if you kill people. Mm. She she's not uncomfortable with herself. You know, she's a, she's a fucking amorphous ass bitch. So yeah. she's not like oh, feel sad for me. He was just like I'm in love with you. She was like I can't love you, nigga. Like. I got a job to do. They don't die, do they? No. They, live for they have to be time. killed. Yeah. And then you get killed like a regular ass. Yeah. You know, a gun will take her all the way out. Yeah, all the way out of here. Yeah. You know what I mean? But the more they are, they can breed into two different things. So they can run as fast as fuck in their tiger form, human form, blah, blah, blah. You know? I like that one. I like, I like that. that. Okay. So they created this empire that that um shit mm-hmm. and um that's when they take over and say like oh this is you know split shit in half mm-hmm. and the war the korean war was really a war to fight against these fucking morphing things okay so like in the in the the screenplay or, or in the movie or whatever it'd be a bunch of niggas fighting fucking tigers Nice. Yeah, you feel me? And it'll be fighting tigers, and it'll be like a tiger, like fucking getting off on a nigga, getting shot in the back, or 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 getting like bayoneted or some shit like that. Paw swipe away, turn to a human, piece up a nigga, get shot in the head. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. that'd be pretty dope. That'd be pretty dope. Yeah. And he he's he's part of the military, and she doesn't kill him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she does it. Like she, he finds himself like walking through the the forest and shit like that, mm-hmm. waiting for a tiger to pop out or whatever the fuck. And then he sees her. And then he sees her. Like they catch eyes, and she's like, "Man, I should fuck you up." And he was like, "I should fuck you up." Not say it, but look at each other like hesitant and shit like that. And then uh, a soldier comes. 
And she like decapitates this nigga. Ah, tears his fucking head off. Or or um she sees him and she doesn't turn into it, but he can tell because she has to tell. Yeah. He can tell that she's one of And she's completely nude. And she can but gorgeous. 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 Thank you. And um he stutters and like maybe he has her in her sight and she doesn't know. Yeah. And so he spares her, so she spares him. And that's how the love grows. Mm-hmm. Is that like she turns around, she's like, and she's like, you've been pointing a gun at me. Why didn't you shoot me? Yeah, and he's seen one of his comrades like getting yeah. fucking ate on. It would, it would be very poetic to have the blood stained on her body. Yeah. Like when you turn back, you are you don't just lose the fur. You know, clean and yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah, it would be, you know. Um, so that, that North Korean empire was built on these changing channels. And the, and the first guy, I forgot, can you look up the first name? The, the first name? The, um, um, the first emperor of, um, North Korea. Uh, it would be Kim the second song. Yeah, yeah, that's the name. Kim Il Sung? I thought it was Kim the second, but that probably is. Yeah. Uh, I don't think it's um, it might be ill. A two. It's, I think it's Kim Hill, so. Or if I'm wrong, email us at the scrapbook podcast at gmail.com. All right, yeah. So that's the first nigga. And he's a and he's a white tiger. You know what I mean? Everybody else is like Bengal colored. Okay, so how many how many of these people are we gonna show? No, so we're, we're not, gonna show the war, but the story is about the two, right? Yeah, so it's about the two, but it's not a hell of a lot. That's why they barely won and, sec- and seceded from. So, are they South Korea? Who? These tigers? No, they're North Korea, but North. Which one's a bad one? North. North. So the tigers are bad. Yeah, the tigers are bad people. But there's that like lore and everything about it, though. There's yeah, exactly. That, like it is a dying. They're dying people. Mm-hmm. And to and to, they have to be kind of open to let their empire grow. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So they went to South Korea. Like, I mean, obviously they're one part part, but they're just like we need mandatory births given, and the humans die in the birth, obviously, because mm-hmm. a whole ass fucking tiger. But we need that. We need that, and they're just like fuck no. It's like, well, this nation is going to be the, you know, whatever the fuck we call the transforming. The, that's the, this, this is going to be the nation. And the guy was just like, nah, suck my dick. And bro was like, bet, hold, 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 wait, wait a second. I got something for you. Full ass tiger on the table, nigga. And he murders the fuck out of the guy. And then the war, war starts right then and there. And it, and it takes place. The first meeting takes place. Well, the DMZ wasn't there at that time, huh? Mm-mm. No, it was. During the Korean War, that's... Remember the nigga who killed everybody with the axe at the DMZ? Mm-mm. I don't remember that. Oh. Uh, yeah, that shit was crazy. I like, you know, you ain't gonna kill seven of my niggas before me and not get shot at least three times. Yeah. I'm lighting you all the way up. Factual. I like it. It turns into... So, he's... He's fleeing North Korea. Who is? The the main dude. He's fleeing North Korea and he runs into this chick. Um, yeah. Yeah, he's fleeing North Korea. Like at this time. Oh, let me. Alright, the DMZ conflict was sixty six to sixty nine. Oh, so we we're good. Oh uh, yeah. Alright, cool. What about like what if they're tracking down people? Mm. And she falls for him. Like she's seeing him, and everybody, and, and maybe he's with with a, a, a group of people, and she's killed a few of them. Yeah, but she doesn't kill him. They're getting picked off. Yeah, and shit. And he's like, "Kill me, nigga!" And then he like yeah. sees her one day, like as he's walking, and he like he sees a woman, and he's like, "Oh my gosh, she's gorgeous!" And then she's going, and he's like, "Oh my god, that's one of them." You can you can tell by the tail. Yeah. Do, t- do tigers like water? Yes, they love water. Okay, yeah, we can make that work. Leave. She can be bathing. 
and he hits the corner or something. Yeah. I don't want her doing any like cat shit, like being a human licking her. Nah, fuck like, no. Nothing fuck like that. No. Fuck but no. like, like old school, like there's tigers in these woods that portray themselves as women. Yeah, like some Kitsune shit. Yeah. Um, and they're not like mystical. They're just really just fucking tigers turning into fucking humans. And yep. Want their population to grow. Mm-hmm. It's in their blood. This is just genetic. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And they're and they're being pushed out of North Korea, going into South Korea, and they're like, we we have to stop mating with these things because if we end up dead. There ends up like being more of them. Yeah. So. We're no longer this place. They're like, what about our population? What about our people? And so they want us to designate peoples to be killed, pretty much, you know? And then they go just like, for the greater good. Like, oh, suck my dick, bro. Yeah, I like it. So it'd be the guy, is he by himself in this fight? I'd say he starts off with other people. Uh huh. And outlasts them. And it'll be like the assassination plot that worked mm-hmm. against no, because no, Kim Il Sung he died like by himself later on. But so it was like an assassination attempt on him. Or I mean, during the Korean War, they had to drop on him. Mm-hmm. They're in there close and shit like that. Then that's when the love shit happens. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? So he's like, "I'm good. I can get the shot off. Mm-hmm. Come up with a plan." There might be like a eight niggas, ten niggas, like, you know what I mean? But like seven of them get taken out periodically throughout the middle and, you know. I like it. He should have to have an emotional attachment to one of the people. Yeah, yeah. That, all... that, that causes, when, when that happens, he's seeing her and he, he let her go a few times. Yeah. Like, and they, they've had their run-ins and then she kills Somebody he knew, and he's just like, you are the reason we're leaving. Like, you are the, yeah. the monster that they're making you guys out to be. Do they have, like, a fucking romantic-ass last fight before one of them has to die? I think uh, I think she should scratch him, and he shoot her, but not kill her. Yeah, but she, like, that's what turns her up, and then she crushes niggas one pipe. Oh. murders the fuck out of him to death like as a tiger yeah. like fucks him up no it should, it should be simple like a quick bite to the back of the neck and she just holds it mm, okay but that has to be a that can't be like a pow shot and then she gets over him and chooses his neck like I, f- I want them to fight each other I think it should be a a, 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 a tiger catching a rat kind of thing where it's like do, do, do. Got you, and but it was just like I yeah. I had you the whole time, yeah. And now that you've provoked me, I'm gonna kill you, yeah, exactly. But like there, because let's be real, there is no fighting a tiger. Yeah, unless I, you had a gun. A tiger. No, you couldn't. <laughs> if you don't have a gun, that your ass out. Yeah, and they carry the rifles, which I think. Movies are portraying niggas with rifles as way too easy to take out of their hands. Mm-hmm. They're like, you just smack the shit out of the barrel, they'll fly with it. I'm like, nah, no, no, no. I just grabbed my sidearm right after that. I'll let it fly out of my hand. But as it's flying out of my hand, I'm reaching for my sidearm. <laughs> and I'm hitting a John Wayne on your ass. <laughs> I think, yeah, I think, I think she kills him. And um, the ending scene is her biting onto his neck and you're just looking into a tiger holding a dead body yeah. as it pans out in the forest. And um, it, it would make sense. These people are bad. Yeah. They ran you out of your country. And then when you cross them, they kill you. Yeah. And instead of losing all of the, all the people... That they that they can, I mean, that they didn't have to, they accept the terms and create that zone, create a cutoff. Yeah, you know what I mean. And then the people now are, you know, obviously slaves and gotta keep them there and shit like that. And but they're made to reproduce. Okay. You know. Yeah. 
Yeah, that could definitely work. They feel about that. Hmm? How you feel about it? I like it. Yeah. I like the I really like the the, the turning into a tiger part. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Pretty dope. Nineteen fifties Asia sci fi. Yeah. Definitely did that. Um what do you name it? A tiger's love. <laughs> <laughs> Mighty Morphin Tigers. <laughs> Um, well, it's nineteen fifties. You gotta, you gotta go kind of like when I already got the the poster of it. The poster it shows a tiger paw imprint and then a human footprint. Oh, okay, I like that. Mm-hmm. Like a tiger turning into the human. Or a tiger's footprint, and then a human's footprint inside. Yeah, like a, like a, it, it, I, I would think more like a tiger steps right here, and then she turned into a human here. Oh, okay, so step, step. Yeah. Well, okay. Like in the snow, because apparently it snows in Korea. Yeah, it does. What do we call that? I'm um, looking up the translation of tiger in, in um, Korean. Ho. Mm, I can't think, I can't. Suho Ray. That's for the white tiger. Suho. Okay, we could just call it that. Suho, S O O H O O. That works. Yeah. I like Suho. I like it too. And, and, and it seems like a porn movie now. It has to be. Yeah, 1950s Asia. Um. And you can adapt to any Asian country. Yeah. That's how we war. Yeah. <laughs> That's all you gotta do. Um Mon- Mongolia and fucking China. But then, you know what I mean? Anybody really in China, they fought a lot of people. Yeah, they fought a lot of people. Uh India and Pakistan, you can do it that way. Um that that'd make a lot of sense because it is actual Bengal tigers in both countries. Mm, I like that one too. Um Civil War in Sri Lanka. Nice and easy. Nice okay. and easy, bro. Uh, thank you for joining us on The Scrapbook. Uh, if you want to expand on any of the stories that we created in any episode, please do. Do not hesitate. Just write it on in. You can send it to us at the scrapbook podcast at gmail.com. You can send us screenplays, short stories, actual plays. Um, if you want to produce them yourselves, please do. Um, like I said, at the scrapbook podcast at gmail.com our instagram is coming soon if not it's already up we love you and uh, don't stop being creative peace peace